I've probably floated the Smith River 25 times. I've been on the Smith River 12 times, actually. Two times. 11 times. It is a place that is so full of mystery and beauty. Every time you go down the Smith, is like the first time. We would sit out in our camping chairs on the beach and watch the sunset. It was like, it was really pretty. The next morning I got up at five and hiked in the dark to the top of the cliffs and watched the moon set opposite Sunset Cliff. Probably my favorite memory is the first year we were on the river. Uh, my kids were four and seven. It poured down rain the whole trip. They got to the end of the river and said, we want to go again. As soon as I close my eyes, I can feel that feeling of when you lift your oars up and the boat just kind of floats just a little bit. I like rowing the boat, even though I'm not great at it. To me, the Smith is on the same level as Yellowstone Park or Glacier Park. I think it's that special a place. We've seen deer cross the river right in front of our boat. We've seen eagles come down and grab fish. Our days on the Smith when the fishing is, is at its best are days that blur in your memory because it's so unbelievable. I've never caught as many fish in a day as I have on a Smith River trip. There are fields of wildflowers. There's beautiful rock cliffs with pictographs. It's not until you're, you're floating along that rock wall two feet from it and you look straight up leaning back in your raft that you realize the grandeur of it. I floated right along the cliff walls and I looked up river as much as down. It turned out to be one of the most memorable trips I ever had and I never put a fly in the water. I've been looking at those cliffs for the better part of my life now and I still see something new every time I look. We wouldn't have uh, generations of family farms and ranches without that river. It's a lifeblood. It's a, a family adventure, and so it really, to me, is representative family or friends who become family. I brought up my son uh, going down the Smith nearly every year from his fourth birthday, and he's a guide on the Smith now. I can't describe it. I can only see it in my mind, and it's, it's one of my fantastic memories.